People are gradually coming out to participate in the fearless October protest in Abuja. As you can see, there are very few individuals here. They have placards. They pose no threats whatsoever to anyone. So why are policemen shooting tear gas at them? They are started shooting us, tear gas. They are, dis they are trying to disperse us. Don't move, comrades, don't move. Don't move, comrades, don't move. Tear gas is supposed to be used to disperse violent protesters or rioters, not peaceful protesters who are walking peacefully by the roadside. And to think that some of these policemen are on minimum wage, which is exactly what these protesters are protesting against. They are protesting for the government to increase the minimum wage to a living wage and the people they are protesting for are the ones shooting tear gas at them. This is a sure way to turn a peaceful protest to a violent one because when policemen start shooting tear gas at peaceful protesters, they become agitated running helter skelter to safety. Some of the protesters might even start throwing back the tear gas canisters at the police which might force the police to start shooting live bullets and all hell will break loose. The situation will quickly turn violent because people will want to retaliate especially when they shoot someone. So why do they always engage in a violent way and Nigerians less human that they can't even express themselves, they can't come out and protest. Protest is a guaranteed fundamental human right, you can't give it to anyone. They are not doing anyone a favor by allowing people to protest. It is the right of Nigerians to protest, especially when there is bad governance. Anyway, the turnout of protesters at the Keja bus stop in Lagos is sizable compared to what we have seen around the country. Maybe people will still come out in other parts of the country, especially in the north. But let's take a listen.